what is our role in the universe. With the size of our planet within our solar system, or maybe we're a small object. When in scale to our galaxy, to the size of our galaxy, we're pretty tiny. And compared to the universe, it's almost, almost insignificant. Almost. And I don't want to be a uh, Debbie Downer and be like, oh, well, what's it all for? What's it all mean? Uh, it's pretty sad. What do you mean my life isn't uh, so tiny? Um... Because as, as I draw and create, you know, we're um, the guy I believe having the greatest impact on the world right now is uh, Elon Musk. And then Donald Trump. I'll say Donald Trump because um, he's clearing things out, clearing out our differences, our obvious differences that are hazardous to our health. Uh, Bronze Age Bronze Age beliefs entitlement from the ego the illusion that uh, everything grows off of trees I'll say Elon Musk is number one with uh, making shit happen around the world because he's the guy that wants to colonize Mars and maybe before I die I think I'll die in of old age that's the plan right I take too many risks in life sometimes but anyways I need to take this risk anyways um you know what's our role in the universe because what is it really to worship fucking Kanye even though he woke, and woke up or listen to bitch ass music like Drake Pre pretend to be cash money and uh, it's all about the bling bitches and fat asses and uh, no disrespect to the nice big round thick asses around the world But with uh, so much conflict, I just uh, want to bring up our uh, the thought of our role, the thought of our role in the universe. You know, before shit gets uh, more out of hand, before. Um, <laughs> Some fucking genius says, I got an idea, let's use nuclear weapons. It's God's will. Praise Allah the merciful. Which is a possibility. And because it's a possibility, I'll mention it, I'll speak about it. I just want to remind everyone uh, of our size, of our planet compared to the size of our ego. I think when I do that, it, uh, I think it helps out. It may not help out the ego, but I think it helps out that other part of us some people call it spirit 
soul, gut, being. I don't know what to call it. And and what a word. Um, really justify it. I also think me listening to Alan Watts makes me want to ponder and share thoughts too. He was just some dude that um, spoke his mind. Uh, I think what I think it's like uh, washing a bathtub, washing a sink, washing an area. that you use it's a part of your life and I think you can only clean it more and more faster more detailed until you realize that it's uh, that's, you know what now that I realize that's a pretty bad example but sort of like you know, once you clean it up you know your mind clear, make things clear I guess it'd be like having all that shit on the sink spit luggies whatever the fucking dirty hands grime And just having all that shit cleared out your mind when you let out your thoughts. Because, uh, I remember there was one dumb motherfucker <laughs> trying to hand over some advice. Yeah, you know, you know, life's all about getting paid and getting bitches. I'm like, really? Why? It just is. It's not, what the fuck you mean it just is? It's like saying, uh, you know, why does the earth rotate? It just does. No, it has to be a fucking reason. You know, something set it in motion that affects other things. And we can come up with the uh, cheesy answer of it's all about love. But, but you know what? There have been times where I've been in, in a relationship and for moments you could forget about uh, time, existence breath, responsibility, I wonder what the hell that is, Or is it that uh, we all we all decide what is our universe? I'm pretty sure a certain lump of uh, dust, or even a civilization on Mars, um, wouldn't concern you as long as it's not affecting your life. So our universe would be that which we know of, and possibly that which affects you.
to, to me it's a bit amusing. We stretch out that. In the year 2017, we still have um, poverty, disease, hunger, war, war. That's the one that um, war. At the, man. I would think that more veterans, that there were much, many more veterans, that there'd be less war. And the reason I say that is, me, I, I understand violence. I understand it. It, do, it doesn't, it doesn't really bug me. It, uh, I won't get all fucking dramatic should something tragic happen in the next heartbeat. But I realize that there's more effective ways of living, a lot more effective ways. It's possible to take things by force, but shit, for every action there's a reaction. And uh, there are just some people that uh, you shouldn't mess with. Should not mess with, buddy. Or is it laughter? Is our purpose laughter? I've got no idea what our significance or purpose is. Just a thought. Um, as I uh, work on these goals in life. I think looking at the um, taking into consideration as much of the world as possible using teamwork abilities and resourcefulness not just resources but resourcefulness you know, we could live in a world that uh, we haven't even uh, imagined of yet. <laughs> 